Queen. Hello. So, in this video, I am going to explain one of the applications that I developed using Flutter. So, the name of the application is DM Codes. Uh, the purpose of this application was to provide you motivational quotes and advices. So I have developed this uh, using Flutter and I have used some of the external libraries for this. Uh, you could see in the pubspack.yml. You could see I have used uh, Firebase AdMob, animated flash screen, page transition, HTTP, bottom navigation bar. So these are some of the dependencies or external libraries that I have used for this project. So first of all, when we open the application, you would see a beautiful animation that is called splash screen. Uh, so I have used this uh, dependency for that. And you could see um, this ad uh, advertisement banner, uh, which is called banner ad. Uh, I have used Fire, uh, Firebase ad mob for this. And you would also uh, see this uh, bottom navigation bar. So it is one of the dependencies that I have used bottom nav bar for this. Uh, so what it does is it helps you to navigate between the screens and it shows a beautiful uh, animation for that as well. So um, I have used HTTP, um, one of the dependencies. Uh, that is used here uh, to fetch the details uh, from the web. So this uses internet and it fetches uh, these quotes and uh, the person who quoted this um, through one of the REST API calls. So when you refresh this, it will fetch you another um, quote and the person who quoted it. So similarly, uh, we have advice section in this application which gives you advice uh, and similarly if you refresh it uh, you will get another advice then we got some uh, joke section in this application that uh, that could be used uh, anywhere to have some light moments and uh, similarly uh, we have the picture gallery for dogs this will fetch up uh, the dog images uh, using the REST API call as well. So every time we refresh this, uh, we will get a new image of the dog. And this is the main page of this application. Here you could uh, see what are the things that uh, this application provides you. Like uh, you could directly navigate to the advice section and you will get the advice here in the full screen mode. And uh, similarly, you could go to about section of this app and you will see what this app really does. So you will see um, about what uh, what is the main purpose of building this app and how it does uh, it, it works. Now, uh, for, uh, if we check the code, uh, then in the main section, you will see all the imported files or the packages that I have used here. Um, then you could see in the material app, I have used an animated nav splash screen, the initial screen that you saw uh, that came up with uh, DM codes and motivational codes, jokes, images. So uh, after that, we have added banner ad here and uh, we have also added bottom navigation bar. So um, in the navigation bar, we have set uh, if we uh, navigate it to home screen, uh, then it will. Uh, th this is the just the UI part, and uh, it will uh, provide you uh, where it will uh, push the content to. Like um, I have added these sections as well, so you could see like the advice dot dart. This imports the HTTP to get the REST API call. This is the URL that it calls and uh, then it sets up the state and fetches the data. And then um, we have uh, put 
like uh, async for this and it will fetch the JSON and decode it. Uh, the decode part of this is here. You can see advice create dot dot. You, uh, you have created an album and slip and you will see from JSON it fetches and maps these details. So you will get the data. You will uh, get ID and you will get advice. Uh, and this is the slip class that is used and it has uh, mapped it uh, like data with this id and uh, uh, advice with the, this advice so you could uh, now go back to that and you can see uh, we have uh, put all the animations uh, or whatever the ui we have used like you could see the circular indicator that uh, says that it's uh, fetching the details and once uh, if uh, the album is not null or uh, when we get the detail uh, then we will have a column a container and similarly it will create the whole UI as soon as it gets all the details and uh, the height of the containers are uh, set using the media query and uh, that's this will uh, like fetch the details um, it will uh, set the container height as per the length or the height of uh, the mobile screen or the screen that uh, this application is being used in. So this is it and similarly you could see all the um, five sections that we have uh, built in this. So thank you for watching. Hope to see you guys in the next video soon. Bye.